beautiful people of YouTube. How you doing today? Yep, it's good old me. Yeah, buddy. And of course, we can thank my buddy Drexted for the music. Yep. Yeah, buddy. Anything you have to say, Drexted? Alrighty, there you are, folks. Jackson doesn't have anything to say, so. Anyway, just, yeah, woo! Good job, Jackson, thank you. Yep. So, anyway, guys, last time we played good old Ocarina of Time, we finished up the Forest Temple, and we destroyed the boss, which was Phantom Ganon. We learned um, a little bit about Link. He is actually not a Kokiri, he is a Hylian. So, and then we kind of ended uh, after the Great Deku Tree Sprout, or sorry, the Deku Tree Sprout, um, telling us our history. That's kind of where it ended. So, but yeah. Anyway, guys, um, so today's video is going to be a side quest video. Um,. It has been a little bit since uh, we've done side quests, so yeah, why not? So anyway, um, this one is it's not technically a side quest. It's just a, a scene I want to show you guys. So if you guys remember, um, Mido, I told you that if we need we needed to come back later to him because we had a, um, I said something about like an interesting scene we need to deal with. So, we're going to look at that real quick, so, yeah. So, um, but yeah. Oh, again, how have you guys been? I have been, I've been, oh, it's, it's been, it's, it's been good, but I've also have had, uh, some rough times this week so yeah it's it's been rough but I've been I've been good though I'm doing all right now compared to um, the last several days but yeah anyway so here's my video. um let, let me show you that scene that we need to um, talk to him with so alrighty here he is oh I see uh, uh, Soraya won't even, or sorry, Soraya won't ever come back. What the heck did I just do right there? <laughs> but I, I promised, um, <laughs> but I, I made a promise to Soraya. Jeez, what is up with my grammar today, guys? If Link came back, I would be sure to tell him that Soraya had been waiting for him. Because Soraya really liked what did she like what did she like <laughs> what did she like wow he didn't tell us who she liked hey you if you see him somewhere please let him know and also I'm sorry for being mean to him tell him that too all right guys so this is actually this is actually quite, um, you know, depressing. So, Mido here, what do you, again, he's referring to Link. He doesn't know this is Link. Um, but he's, um, what he was referring to is Soraya actually, um, really liked, liked Link. Like, she was in love with Link. And, you know, Soraya was a little devastated that, you know, Link had to leave and, you know, he had to become a hero of some type. And so she's, she was a little sad that, um, he had to kind of abandon her, even though he, she, or sorry, she really enjoyed him. And then Mido feels really bad for what he did to Link when he was younger, you know, like teasing him, um, being rude to him, all that stuff. You know, kind of like how I began the Let's Play. You kind of saw how rude he was to um, young Link. Um, that's what he was referring to. But, yeah, that's really, really quite sad and emotional. So, 
but but yeah um anyway guys um that is the scene alrighty I am going to cut right here and I will see you guys in Kakariko Village so I will be right back alrighty guys I'm back so we're back in Kakariko Village and we have a little bit of things to do um, here um we're going to get a upgrade to our ferry bow um if you remember like the slingshot um you got as a kid you know that little type of shooting at our gallery area um we're gonna do that I mean, abby what do you want that cloud over death mountain there's something strange about it yeah yeah but we'll deal with that a little bit later so if you remember this area as Kid Link, if, remember, if you remember that gold sculptula that we got when we did gold sculptula hunting here as um, Young Link, um, this was still under construction. Um, there was a carpenter, carpenter that was running around on top and yeah. If you come here as an adult, um, looks like it's finally finished and it became a shooting gallery as you can tell right there. So. We're going in here and we're going to play the little mini game to get our upgrade to our ferry boat. So, um, just so you know, it has been a while um, since I have done this. So, I don't know if I'll get it on my first try. It might take me two tries. Um, just bear with me. Um, it's literally just like the slingshot. You shoot the rupees. But, the rupees here are, um, the order's different as compared to Kid Link. It's a little bit easier. Um, as adult link it's a little bit harder it's still easy it's just a little bit harder the rupee order is different but yeah anyway um let's talk to mr fat lips i guess and he tells you it's 20 rupees and he's like okay this game is for grown-ups hyrule's famous shooting ground learning apparently it's only for grown-ups <laughs> and then he just tells you how to um you know how to shoot and crap but I already told you so and if you remember from the slingshot yeah anyway um just let me focus i do apologize that there won't be any commentary um for this little bit but all right there we go Oh, guys, we did it. Whew. Very first try. Whew. Feels good. Oh, man. And as he says, he says, Wonderful! Bravo! Perfect! It's literally what I'm feeling right now. Oh, my gosh. It usually takes, like, at least another try. I usually mess up on the first time, but not today. Whew. So, alrighty. Yeah. Here's a fantastic present. So for doing this, we yeah we get big quiver. So now we can carry 40 arrows instead of 30. So yeah, alrighty, let's let's get out of here. Oh, feels good. Alrighty, guys. So there's one other thing, and then I will explain what we're going to do probably for the rest of the video. Or yeah. So if you remember this good old area, good old house of Skultula, it's been here, or been a while since we've been here. So if you remember that we killed 51 um, spiders, if you talk to this guy right here. The curse has been broken, thank you, here's a reward for you. What's he going to give us? And he has given us a piece of heart. We have collected three. Sweet. So, and for that fellow viewers... We have rescued all the the kids that are in here. So, but what about this guy? So, as you just so you know, this is the their father, and he's like, "Thank you for saving my kids." What me? Oh, that's okay. You have already destroyed fifty-one spiders of the curse so far, so that's fine. Don't worry about me. We are gonna worry about you because. I said this is going to be 100%, so we're going to get all the gold sculptures. 
Um, so do not worry, buddy. We're gonna we're gonna make you human just like your kids. So alrighty. Anyway. So for the rest of the, the uh <laughs> what the heck am I saying right there? Um for the rest of the video we're going to be hunting some poes that are around Hyrule. Um big poes in fact. Um there are a total of ten that are in around the land of Hyrule, but there are certain spots that they will only appear when it comes to finding them. So, um, thing though about when it comes to these, we're going to have to empty our bottles. Um, so yeah, we already have two fairies, the bug, and yeah. So, I know we have to re release the fairies of the bug, but it's the only way to do this quest because um, when you pick up a pole you put him in the bottle so yeah <laughs> I can't believe we have to get rid of these I've worked so hard to get all these uh, don't worry we'll we'll get them later first yeah we'll get them later sometime through the let's play again don't worry but for now we're going to just we're gonna empty the bottles and yeah so alrighty and hi Epona it's been a while since we've seen you I know girl how you been so anyway let's let's put back on the items we need so but yeah that's what we're gonna do is we're going to go and kind of ghost hunt again but they're big ghosts. So. Alright, I'll show you where the um, first three, and then I will probably cut um, the next seven, just so to make it a little bit easy on myself. So, you see where this sign that we're cutting in front of the, the castle? So if you stand by this sign with a Pona, you see that? That's a big Po. So what we need to do is we need to shoot it twice and it moves though so we're gonna make sure to get it uh, or follow follow its movement so so it started right there and then it started to move kind of towards the side so we got to figure out kind of its movement pattern and then we got to shoot it twice to be able to drop its remains so oh I hit it once but um got to do it again we got to Hit him twice. All right, we killed him. Sweet. So, and then he drops his remains, and then what we do with these remains is we're going to put it in a bottle. You defeat the Poe, the ghost. Do you want to keep it, or sorry, do you want to catch it? And then we want to say yes. We caught a big Poe. And then we sell it to the ghost shop for a lot of money. Probably wondering, what in the heck is the ghost shop? Well, we'll talk about that probably in a minute or so. Alrighty, that's the first pole. So now the next one is right by this tree. So, kind of just got to... Oh, I heard it. So we need to kind of line up with this tree. And about mm, probably right here. All right, now we gotta wait for it to reappear. All right. Okay, so it starts about right here. So yeah, kind of some boring stuff, but oh well, it's just side quest. And personally, ah, uh, never mind. I was a little bit off. Um. You don't have to do this, you can actually do this a little bit later, but I just gonna get it done, so. Ah! Oh, geez, I was off a bit. Did I just shoot? The heck? Huh, oh, whatever. Perfect. Alrighty. So yeah, um, <laughs> uh, I might, <laughs> um, 
Jeez, it's... Yeah, this... It, this isn't really fun, but it's part of being 100%. So I actually might... I might... What I'll do is I'll probably show the areas after these three. Just show you... Show you where you do, and then I will probably just... Um cut and then just shoot them myself because yeah really quite boring all right the next one is i want to say okay you saw it but it disappeared into the wall so it's about right here this middle bush so yeah all right let's see if we can figure out where it starts so it starts about there Alrighty, wait, 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 wait in music. Ugh. Yeah, okay. So, once we've killed these, um, probably referred to that shot that it just did. You defeated the ghost. Do you want to catch it in a bottle? Yes, we do. That's literally what it says. So, let's see, that should be the three, yes. Yeah, alright. So, we're going to go to a ghost shop that it said. And where this shop is, it's in town. So. But yeah. So yeah, what I'll probably do is, I'll probably show you the location of where the ghost is. Um, and then, I will probably just... Um, off screen all the shooting until we have all the ghosts complete so if you come in here and if you remember this door if you actually remember this area as a kid this used to be where you can get all those pots and there was a guard so but now apparently it's some really weird guy with a red eye that wears a triforce and has a really weird stick so oh you are quiet energetic young man you're brave and handsome too oh what jeez mate or oh uh <laughs> your name is link isn't it uh how do you know that <laughs> don't be surprised i can read people's minds oh you can can you so what am i thinking about right now huh huh did you just say did you just say I was thinking about tacos. Nope. You can't read people's minds. You liar. If I looked as good as you, I could run a different kind of business. <laughs> yeah, okay, that just got a little bit of sexual right there. But anyway. My shop is the only ghost shop in Hyrule. Because of the great Ganondorf, it is a fine time for business like this. <laughs> Oh, I can only hope the world gets even worse. Oh, jeez. Why do you want that to happen, mate? The ghosts called Pose are spirits of... Con... Contracted? Hatred... Of... Pardon. That appear in the fields and in the graveyard. They hate the world. Young man, if you catch a Poe, I will pay a lot of money for you. Hee hee hee. So, so yeah, this is the, the ghost shop guy. And so what you do, guys, is we take um, these big posts and we sell it to them. Um, oh, you brought a Poe today. Hmm, very interesting. This is a big Poe. I'll buy it for 50 rupees. And as you can tell, I, only, I have 462. So that's a, probably another thing. I might go off screen my rupees. So, I can actually earn money instead of, you know, actually wasting it. So, on top of that, I'll put 100 points on your card. So, if you earn 1,000 points, you'll be a happy man. Hey, <laughs> hey. So, so, he gives you 50 rupees, he takes the po, and then he gives you this little card, and he says, once you have reached 1,000, you'll be happy or something. So, all right. So what I'm going to probably do is I'm going to probably off screen, probably go drain my m money and then um, go find the other posts. So 
But yeah, so I will be right back. Yeah, so. Alrighty guys, um, if you guys remember what I just said a little bit earlier about, um, finding the ghosts, um, so I'm actually going to show you where three of them, um, each time, um, while I'm cutting, so I'll show you four, five, six, and then where seven, eight, nine, and then the last one, I'll show you where they're located, so number four is located right here, kind of by this tree, you can tell right there. <clears throat> And then number five is located kind of about right here, I believe, kind of about here. So number five is located right there. And then number six is located, uh, Pona, why didn't you jump over the fence? Number six is located kind of by this tree kind of um kind of go gotta go about heavy yeah so about right here so kind of about right here is where ghost number six will be so i'll show you where those are and then yeah so i will see you when i locate seven eight nine Alrighty guys, so um, this is where pole number 7 is, is this location right here, as you can tell. So 7 is located about here, kind of where I showed you where 6 was, just a little bit kind of downward. So, and then we're going to go up by this rock, so about this rock, yeah, about right here, that is ghost number 8. And then ghost number nine is about if you, you might have saw it, but I'll get you a better picture. So kind of about right here is where ghost number nine is. This picture. Or sorry, not this picture, this area. This is where ghost number nine. So Alright, and then where the last one is located, I'll show you. So if you come about over here, um, kind of really close to um, Kiriko Village. So if you come about, nope, back up, I need back up. So if you kind of about right, about right here, or so about right here. I believe yeah about right here yeah about right here is where ghost number 10 is so and that is where all the ghosts are located so all right guys i will see you when we have all the ghosts defeated so i will bear it back all righty guys okay as you can tell by my arrows it says eight yeah um i hate the side quest just you know but i got all the pose so Let's hand in this last one and see what the reward is. Oh, you brought a photo today. It kind of just says the same thing. <clears throat> and we, we did. We have earned a thousand points. Wait a minute. Wow. You have earned a thousand points. Young man, you are a gen genuine ghost hunter. <laughs> yeah, I am. Is that what you expected me to say? Hey, hey, hey. Because of you, I have an extra inventory of big posts, so this will be the last time I can buy a ghost. You are thinking about what I promised would happen when you earn a thousand points. Hey, <laughs> hey. Don't worry, I didn't forget. Just take this. And for doing this most hatred quest, probably in this game, we get an empty bottle. Yeah, it's kind of lame, but yeah, it's, yeah. But here's the good thing though, guys, for doing that though, we have all the empty bottles. Finally, no more bottles we have to collect. 
So, but yeah, I hate, this is probably my most hated side quest in Ocarina of Time. I just, I hate the pose. So, anyway guys, um, yeah, I apologize about it being another side quest video or, yeah, whatever, but, alright guys. Make sure to like, make sure to subscribe, make sure to comment, make sure to do whatever, and I'll see you next video. Until then, bye!